Hey Liam, what are we doing today? We're opening Tommy! We're opening our Thomas and Friends Tommy collection. Yeah! We found a huge collection. We were very lucky to find it. It was all still in the boxes, so we thought we'd open them all up and have some fun with it. Yeah! Thomas, Elizabeth, Birdie Bus, Rusty, Bulgy, Mavis, Diesel, Toby and Henrietta, Edward, Duck. And Duck Scott. Well, who else do we have? We have Thomas and the Jet Engine. And this big set is the Thomas Water Tower Steam Set. Yeah. Not only that, but our friends at Totally Thomas Towns got us a bunch of tracks as well. What set do you want to open first, William? Uh, this. You want to open up the big box first? Yeah. yeah. Let's get to it. So this set is from 2006, making it about 12 years old. When Thomas runs out of steam, refill him with the real working water tower. The Thomas Water Steam Set features a real working water tower. Press on the pump to release real water into Thomas's water tank. Thomas is now ready to continue to steam along. Thomas emits cool puffs of steam as he moves along the track. See the billowy steam and a red LED light glow from Thomas's funnel as he chuffs under his own motorized power. So this apparently makes real steam that is cool to the touch. Through the tunnel, through the bridge, and through the station. He's going through a lot here today. Let's see how they packed things up 12 years ago. There it is. Wow, look at that set. That's a really good looking set. I look at it here. Well, that's an interesting connector. Thomas looks very metallic. Oh, he already comes with the Annie attached. Okay, well, let's pull him out and take a look. Let's take a look at this to metallic Thomas. So we can bend him pretty good there. That's a big connector. I've never seen a connector like that before. I had. No, you hadn't. I think that might be where we fill up. And then there's, he's got opening steam puff in there. Uh, a tunnel. You have a big tunnel, don't we? Yeah. See, even it's easy for a four-year-old. This must be a refueling station here. Here is, I'm assuming, where we put the water. Hey, did you just do that yourself? Yeah. I love how you just figure things out. That Henry's tunnel? You yeah. got that figured right out. Platform one, that's where Gordon would go. Platform two, that's where Spencer would go. Oh, and it even tells you where the trains are. This is a really unique platform. I really like the details in this. Probably a lot of people watching the video thinking, I can't believe they opened that. These are interesting. These are like rubbery almost. Hey, I think I found out where the ladder goes. Yeah, you found it out too, didn't you? Oh, okay, this is a steam filter that goes inside Thomas. There's one already in there. This is just a spare. I like it how it spells Tommy here. You like how it spells Tommy there? That's yeah. interesting. Yeah. I read it, but I'll As opposed to any other Thomas blue track thing. So there we have the bridge built up. Is that accurate? Is that good? Get the curve and we'll pop that into there like that. Tunnel just fits over everything like that. Let's take a look at this set. What do you see from this set, William? We've got a tunnel, we've got a bridge, we've got a station, and we've got the water tower. Here we have the Thomas train set. So Annie takes three AA batteries, one in the bottom, two in the top. And then the one in the bottom, there's a switch down here. If you that's the lights and sounds. All right, we're gonna test this set out. We've got the water tower filled up with distilled water like it asked for. We'll keep that up. Are you ready to get going with Thomas? Yeah. I wanna see what happens here. Do we have his sounds on? Yeah. Oh, look at that LED light. You can stop him right there. Oh yeah, that sound sounds really good. Let's see if that'll work, if we can fit that in there. We see some water going in. Yeah, that water's going down. I'll turn this on, are you ready? Yes. Let's see if Thomas can make some steam. There's that big red light of his. Do you see it? I see a little bit of steam in there, you're right. There is a little bit of steam. Yeah, there's steam coming out. Yeah, he's steaming up a storm now. Go, go, Thomas. Thomas and the steam. Oh. You're just switching points, are you? This is a good little set. Thomas is really going. He's got the steam. Yeah, you can feel it. It's actually very cool steam coming out of there. Oh, and red. I love his sights and sounds. He's a nice little metallic guy. He's got that red light coming on. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think we're going to put food coloring in there. We don't want to make food coloring steam. He's really going, too. This guy might be a good racer. Hey, Thomas, you want to race the other engines on our racetrack? What do you think? Go, go, Thomas. Over the bridge. It's a, it's so we're gonna get him to come back in. We're gonna stop him. Yeah, he stopped right away, we'll turn him off. 
Oh wow, the steam came out there. Let's fill them up again. So we'll just pop that right in there. You know how to pump them up. We're having a little overflow. Yeah, we are having a little bit of overflow. Okay, that's good. Now go. Who really knows this guy? I really like this guy. This is a great little set. Oh, Look at that. Wow. Yeah, that's fantastic. You gonna make some steam? Yeah. Here's Thomas. We've extended the track quite a bit. What do you think of this new track, William? Awesome. I love how much you just put a little bit of water in Thomas, and he just goes right to town with that steam. I'm real glad we got all this track. He's just going right around. Let's bring him back and get some more steam in him, maybe. So about three squirts is what he takes to fill. Let's let Thomas puff around soda over here. I love that steam coming out of him. Thomas is like, I'm shiny. Is he, yeah, he is shiny. I'm shiny. We're gonna stop him just so everyone can see what happens when he stops with the steam. That's a lot of steam coming out. Yep. Thomas and the jet engine. This is Thomas and the jet engine. Yeah, Thomas, it, it comes extra with fast the Thomas. We're gonna race him. Jet engine, LED light. And includes a DVD. Oh wow, that's gonna be some fun. Thomas looks a little bit concerned that we might be opening him up. Watch Thomas and the Jet Engine and recreate the adventure. Well, here he is in all his glory. Upset Thomas, freight, and then after the freight is the jet engine. The jet engine looking really interesting. I bet that lights up and makes a great sound as well. On off switch right there. On off switch right on Thomas as well. So here we have him, extra fast Thomas, or as advertised. All the motors in Thomas. We have some freight car right here that does nothing. And then we have the jet engine. Unique to say the jet engine actually doesn't have a motor in it. We just have a switch right here. All it does is light up the LED light at the back when the wheels turn. He's going fast and the jet engine because the wheels are turning is just lighting up like crazy. I want to know if he really is extra fast. Let's get this metallic guy on here and see if they can catch up. So he's going. I don't know how much faster he really is, but he is going. This Thomas seems to be going just as fast, if you ask me. I do not like that light-up jet engine, but I do wish there was another motor inside of it. Oh, here we go. Oh! Double derailment. I don't know. I don't think that extra fast Thomas is too extra fast as compared to this other one. Oh, he's not. Patella Thomas is actually faster than extra fast Thomas. And he's, look, he just he, proved it. Yeah, look, he's getting blasted. Oh, he's getting blasted by the jet engine. Yeah. I hope the jet engine blasts this guy away. Well, there we have it. We got brand new batteries in both of these guys, but extra fast Thomas with the jet engine just is not extra fast at all as compared to Metallic Thomas. And look at that. Oh, derailed. I love this guy, even when he's pulling both Annie and Clarabelle. This guy was advertised as being faster than other Tony play rails. He was just pulling the jet engine and he is not as fast as the other guy, that is for sure. Do you want to open up another one, William? Yeah. Which one do you want to open up? Here we have Duck, he comes with some tracks. Looks like four curved pieces, um, even more curved pieces. He also comes with Scruffy. For those of you that don't know, Scruffy is kind of the leader of the troublesome trucks. Duck is a cheerful and busy engine. He's only a small tank engine, but Coming as he does from the Great Western Railroad, he'll stand no nonsense whatsoever from larger engines who try to order him about. You ready to open this guy up? Yep. Duck. Duck is, a, he's a very popular guy on our channel. A lot of people like Duck and they're always asking for more Duck. And it came with Scruffy, that's Scruffy's face. Uh, if any of you haven't seen a Tommy Scruffy. A lot more detail on the side. I've, I've always kind of been a Scruffy fan. I. Wish that he hadn't been destroyed because he's super awesome. Going fast is the great western way. And he goes remarkably slow. I'm a little bit disappointed. Duck is not, just not going as fast as I was hoping he would. Here he is coming up on Annie and Clarabelle and you can see already, Duck is not gonna be one of our racing champions taking that big C battery. Tom is just giving her, whoosh. Going fast is not the great western way. Who do you think is popular with 
Our, yeah, you're right. Our community loves Toby. Our viewers love Toby. Let's get this guy. Oh, you're not even wasting time. So here's Toby, Henrietta, and comes with some cargo. Toby comes with another troublesome truck, just a lot like Scruffy, just not as cool as Scruffy. Also no cargo. Let's take a look at Henrietta. Henrietta, no character uh, face on this Henrietta either, just like the wooden railway. Toby, looks like Toby. Well, this is about as good as Toby as it can get. Comes off very easily. That takes another C battery. Let's see what he Toby can do here. Another kind of a slow poke. I think that some of these C batteries are just not as fast as one would expect. Here comes Toby. He's going to come right up to this Steam Thomas, and we're going to get Steam Thomas go. And you can see Steam Thomas pulling away and how much faster Steam Thomas is than Toby. Oh, yeah. Thomas is now shunting Scruffy. Now Scruffy's going faster than he ever wanted. Good thing Toby's got Henrietta, not Hasty Hannah. That would be a much different story as far as Toby's going. Toby is carrying Scruffy because Scruffy got hurt. Whoa, did Scruffy get hurt? Oh, well he got hurt again, Thomas. Interesting to note, Toby did not come with any Tommy tracks, but he did have two cars as opposed to just the one. Oh. Silly steamy. Oh, you want to get Diesel out? Here's Diesel 2005. He comes with the milk crate. I think we have this milk cargo crate somewhere else. I'm looking forward to Diesel, but he's another C battery. He might not just be as fast as some of these AA batteries. So and here he is straight. inside the box. We've got the four straight tracks and we've got Devious Diesel right there. Here we are, milk car. Nothing really spectacular about that. Just a nice milk car. Diesel going in with that Tommy detailing. Big smirk on his face. He's devious, this one, ready to go. Very easy to pop the top off of these ones. Oh wow, he's really bottom heavy. Like he's back heavy. That's a bigger motor maybe. Maybe we're gonna see a little bit more out of Diesel than we did out of Duck and Toby. What do you think? I don't think Diesel's going any much faster either. Silly schemies. Let's have him race against Toby here. Is Toby whooshing in front? That's very nice of you. Wow, Diesel might be our slowest one yet. Oh well, do you want to open up another one? 